Well, while summer vacation is a time to rest and relax, it can also be a prime time for home burglaries. You may not have thought about that. Well, according to the U.S. Department of Justice, crime rates increase about 10% in the summer as more thieves are watching for signs, of course, of empty homes. Right now, joining us here in the studio, we do have Clint St. Mosley from U.S. Thank you so much for coming in. Thanks for having us. You have quite a few interesting and maybe unique ways for people to protect their home. And one of the good things I like is these aren't going to break the bank. Absolutely. So very, very cost-effective ways to protect your home and monitor your home. So like I said, the weather's getting better. People are out on vacation. We have a couple things here, a couple of devices and a couple apps. Mm -hmm. So what you need for these is a smartphone or a, a tablet like this iPad Air 2. These will keep you, what you do is you hook this up to your Wi-Fi, mm -hmm. and when you're away, whether across the country or even down the street, you can keep an eye on your dog, you can keep an eye on your house. Even if you have babysitters, you can keep an eye on, on that. The nanny cam, as lots of people refer to this as, but when mm -hmm. you're on vacation, this could be a handy tool, and how much does this cost? These are run anywhere from 60 to $80, to dollars, and there's no monthly charge. So it's a good way to keep you connected and safe. So rather than necessarily a home security system, which might also be a good option for some people, but if they don't want to go that route, this is kind of a cheaper, more affordable way they can monitor it themselves. Absolutely, and there's a lot of free apps. You can. This is just an old phone I have, a smartphone. You probably mm -hmm. have an upgrade. You may have some in your drawers. Um, all you need is a wireless connection, like a 4G network, and you can use apps like ManyThing for Apple, mm -hmm. or there's one called Salient Eye, and you just hook these up. You literally sit them anywhere in your home, and you can monitor using these apps. And if you wanted to just monitor, it's free. If you do want some storage options to keep it for a couple weeks, mm -hmm. um, or even up to a month, you can pay to have that. But it's a very simple and cost-effective way to do that. So your old phone could be a security camera for you, yeah, essentially. Yeah, your old phone, your own I iPads, Android nice. devices. You just have those. And this is a fabulous little device. I can see me running out and getting one of these this evening. Oh, yes, I love this to keep you safe. So this uh, is a Belkin. It connects to your Wi-Fi and it's controlled through your smartphone mm -hmm. or tablet. And what, one of the best uses for this is to plug a lamp into it. So if you're coming home, maybe a single lady at night, you want to have a light on, but you don't want to keep that light on the entire day, you just plug this into the Belkin you control it on your smartphone. That way it's, it's a lot better than leaving that light on for the entire week you're gone. That's another yeah. dead giveaway exactly, that yeah. someone's not there. You know, you're monitoring that. So this is an easy way way to connect it and, uh, and control it. You can control TVs, lamps, multiple devices as well. Lots of interesting ideas. Clint, we appreciate you coming in. Thank you so very much. I've learned a lot as well. In fact, again, I might just take this one with me. All right. All right. Thank you so very much. Appreciate it. Well, I'm going to watch it and see if you walk out. <laughs>